Temperatures are set to soar over the next couple of days. Monday and Tuesday will set historic highs across the UK. Looking at the high temperatures today though, July 17th we reached maximums of around 31 degrees generally in the uh, middle part and eastern parts of the country, even in the northwest in Manchester and in Rill, 30 degrees uh, in North Wales. Low temperatures early this morning fell to 10 degrees at Charlwood in uh, Sussex I think that is, and 11 degrees in Bournemouth, 12 in many other locations. Well, looking towards tomorrow, uh, the excessive heat warnings uh, extending over most of England and Wales, an enormous area there that are going to receive extremely high temperatures. These temperatures will be some of which we've never seen before across the UK and in many places in Europe. So it's something that uh, really needs to be taken seriously. We take a look through this evening. Cloud cover will uh, start to sink towards the north there. Low temperatures around 15 degrees Celsius generally across uh, the UK and Ireland. Uh, it will be a bit breezy along the eastern coast but generally calm. Cloud cover towards the north there, a clear night further south. Moving into Monday, uh, lots of areas there which will receive hot sunshine. Um, it will even get to around 28 degrees up in Inverness and in Aberdeen. Some areas there might get to 30 degrees. Looking further south, it will be into the lower 30s in the eastern part of Scotland as well. Uh, up to around 33 in the northeast of England where excessive heat warnings are in effect. Further south, temperatures have downtrended slightly from yesterday's forecast but we're still expecting 39 degrees in quite a few areas across central England into eastern Wales and in southwestern England and parts of southeastern England as well. 39 degrees the expected high but we can't rule out one or two locations getting to 40 degrees Celsius. Bearing in mind the current heat temperature record record across the UK is 38.7 that is likely to get beaten in numerous locations on Monday. Generally decent uh, conditions there uh, in terms of cloud cover, hardly any. Uh, Ireland will be a little bit cloudy and cooler, a um, little bit breezier along the eastern coast as well but not much wind on Monday. Looking into Monday night, it's going to be an extremely warm night for most parts of the country. 23 degrees, the low temperature across uh, England there, and that is the absolute low. Some areas probably won't fall below 27. Looking at Tuesday, extremely hot temperatures once again, although the cold front will start to move through the westernmost peripheries of the country. Uh, Western Scotland there falling to 16 degrees as a high on Tuesday in Stornoway. But east of it, you can see these temperatures really rising, even though it's cloudier. 31 degrees in northern Scotland, 42 degrees Celsius on tap for parts of northeastern England or eastern England, Yorkshire, Lincolnshire, um, and down towards East Anglia. 41 also before the cold front moves in in northwestern England, whose rep temperature record currently sits at 35. That would be beaten by over 6 degrees Celsius. Uh, 41 degrees also in parts of the central eastern England there, 40 expected in London as well with partly cloudy conditions. These are very dangerous temperatures that are likely to cause uh, significant uh, issues for people, particularly vulnerable groups, and we will be expecting a significant amount of fatalities from this event. Winds will start to get up uh, moving into Tuesday night into Wednesday morning and you can see the cloud cover increasing with a little bit of areas of rain there and temperatures will start to decrease. A low of 20 though in East Anglia. Moving into Wednesday during the day rain will start to uh, give relief to parts of Western England and Wales into Eastern Scotland there. A significant band still high temperatures towards the east but not as high 29 degrees the high expected on wednesday with 27 in london temperatures behind that front falling to more seasonal values of around 22 to 23 degrees as a high temperature Please take this seriously, we'll be running an automated stream in a couple of hours probably and we'll be leaving it running all the way through this event providing you the latest observations and information in real time. Please share it and please stay safe out there ahead of this big weather event.